frogs. In the desert? That doesn't sound right. Frogs are amphibians. Everybody knows frogs lay their eggs in the water. And their young, tadpoles, need water to grow up in. Frogs need to keep their skin moist in order to survive. So the desert seems the least likely of places to find them. And yet, they're here. Several species of frogs, including those we call toads, are found in the desert. By the way, toad is a name used for certain kinds of frogs. All toads are frogs, but not all frogs are toads. Frogs have different strategies for surviving in arid regions. Some, like the lowland leopard frog, simply live where water occurs. Some streams in Saguaro's Rincon Mountain District harbor this protected species. Canyon tree frogs live on boulders along stream courses with water just to hop away. Toads become active when the summer monsoon storms occur, late June to late September. Males gather at ponds and begin calling to attract mates. Eggs are laid and fertilized in the water, which soon hatch out into tiny tadpoles. These need to grow and develop into frogs before the water dries up sometimes in as little as nine days. During the winter and dry seasons, toads go underground, some Sonoran Desert frogs. Lowland Leopard Frog Canyon Tree Frog Red Spotted Toad Great Plains Toad Sonoran Desert Toad, our largest native frog Western Green Toad Sonoran Green Toad Couches Spadefoot Frogs face many challenges in our modern world. Habitat destruction, pollution, disease, competition from introduced exotic species, climate change. They will need our help if we don't want them to disappear. You can help. Support parks and refuges. Conserve water and habitat. Join conservation groups. Help us keep frogs in the desert.